Hey y'all, I'm coming at you with a little haul from The Necessities. I really love The Necessities. I love her cotton candy. I have itchy eyes today. I have been cleaning and unloading boxes. Um, I'm finally like unpacking stuff and like after I was done doing some of those, it doesn't help that I'm not feeling well. Rambly story short. Um, my eyes are itchy and I don't feel the greatest, but I really want to get this done and upload it because I'm trying to like get caught up on all this after the constant moving over the last, uh, you know, six months to a year. It's been a lot. Emotionally, physically, mentally, every way that it could be, it has been. So I'm very happy to be settled and um, I'm hoping I don't have to move anytime soon. So, all right, let's get started with this haul. So I got a poop ton of cotton candy because I really like it as a hot tea latte. I haven't tried it as an iced tea latte. I believe Stacy from As The Tea Brews has, has done it as an iced tea latte, and I think they did it with a shot of raspberry matcha. I love this tea a lot. Um, I like it as a hot tea latte. I did try it iced. I will say iced. It's quite sweet to me. Um, I don't think I would make it a strong next time. I think I made it a little strong for me. Um, but oh my god, the flavor is really good. So I have some sweet tea fanatics in my family that would quite love this. I'm not going to lie though, all four of these, yeah, they're for me. They're not for other people. They're for myself because I really like to make the tea lattes with this. And I want to try an iced tea latte. I feel like this would taste like a liquid milkshake. It would be amazing. Right? I deserve that in my life. And that's what I'm going with. <laughs> it's like, that's the theory I'm going with. I picked up four ounces of her strawberry lemonade based on the fact that I've also had the peanut butter cup. And even the peanut butter cup that the Necessities makes by itself, like I have gone and not put nothing, not put anything in it. And it's amazing. Uh, my brother's also had it while he was here. He was He's a huge tea fan, and he really liked it. Um, so I went with the theory that I really like strawberry lemonade, and I went with the theory that I'm probably really going to like this. So fingers crossed. I hope I really like this. It just sounds really good. And, um, yeah, so it's got apple, pineapple, pear, strawberry, red currants, which is going to make it nice and sweet, lemon peel, lemon granules, marigold, petal, marigold petals, and flavoring. I'm just going to take a little sip of my tea, even though it's in a coffee cup. I'm just having plain um, iced tea, black decaf. And I recently went to the Hawaiian Coffee Association meeting. Um, so I picked this up because this is cool, and I like these, like, nice insulated cups. They're great. Uh, yeah. I picked up two ounces of the almond biscotti because I was curious about it. And I thought, well, I mean, it's got like um, apple, slivered almonds, chopped almonds, organic cinnamon, orange peel, beetroot, and flavoring. It just sounded really delicious. Uh, I picked up a rooibos from her. I picked up the fruit punch, which I think I picked up before. Uh, usually anything she makes that's fruity or delicious, I don't know. I haven't had anything of hers I don't like. So this is a green rooibos, which uh, the only other green rooibos that I've tried is the root beer tea from Tizanti, and I love it. So I'm going with the theory that I'm also hopefully going to love this one. So it's green rooibos, lemongrass, orange peel, marrow petals, rose hips, freeze dried strawberries, natural and no organic flavor. So. Um, and then I got strawberry rose champagne. It's an herbal one. I, again, uh, just picked up two ounces to try because it sounded really good and exciting. So it's um, apple, papaya, red and pink rose petals, strawberries, raspberries, pink cornflower blossoms, and natural flavors. And I am okay with flowers in my tea. I don't know. In general, I really quite like it. As long as it's not like... Lavender is one I feel like can get overpowering really quick. And so can rose petals, but there's not enough in there to, like, scare me. So. And then she sent some samples. She sent three samples, which is really nice. And um, she sent candy ginger, which I'm really excited because I wanted to try this one. Um, coconut macaroon. Macaroon. I've also been really tempted to try. Um, 
So it's got apple, pineapple, coconuts, toasted coconut chips, blackberry leaves, yogurt granules, freeze dried marzipan, almond pieces, and flavoring. Honestly, that one just sounds like dessert. Um, and this one's apples, crystallized ginger, ginger root, orange peel, marigold petals, and natural flavors. And then this one I thought was really cute. It's really funny that she sent <laughs> this tea called Aloha. It's a, a green rooibos with orange, pineapple, coconut, and a touch of vanilla for the perfect tropical treat. You couldn't have sent it to a better place. <laughs> I was like... It's really funny that she sent <laughs> this tea called Aloha. It's a, a green rooibos with orange, pineapple, coconut, and a touch of vanilla for the perfect tropical treat. You couldn't have sent it to a better place. <laughs> I was like... Literally. <laughs> I'm like... The ocean's right there. <laughs> like, you can see it out the window. Um, so, yeah. So, uh, thank you for the samples. I really enjoy them. She, you, I think, I've never not gotten a sample when I have ordered from her. This is my, either my second or third time ordering. I really love the cotton candy tea, obviously. Um, it makes amazing, like, hot tea lots. I'm just saying, I really need to try it iced, and I want to try it with a shot of matcha. But it's so good. I love it a lot. And, um, yeah, so I'm excited to try my samples. I'm excited for all my new teas. And that's it. This is a short video. I'm going to keep drinking my tea because I'm feeling more hydrated now that I'm drinking it. Ugh, I'm going to have to refill that. I'm almost out already. <laughs> Anyhow, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, let me know any comments, suggestions, questions, concerns, any tea suggestions from the necessities or anyone else, let me know below. I'm always loving to try new teas and looking for new things to get into, uh, beverage-wise. And uh, yeah, I hope you have a wonderful evening, morning, afternoon, whatever it is, wherever you are. I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.